Constantino. Ole. Pound for pound. Middle Giant Bubu, what do you think about David Benavides as a fighter? Uh, I think he's, um, you know, um, a really elite fighter. Not the very best skillful fighter, but I think he's definitely a great fighter. What's the headline going to read on Sunday night? In the new WBC interim super middleweight champion of the world, Demetrius Andre. What's your thoughts when he says he faced off with you and he said he felt that you were scared? I mean, did I look scared up there? I no. don't know. I mean, I'm just saying that. Like, cool, calm, collected. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. But if you scare me, it's going to be more dangerous at the end of the day. I'm going to want to fight harder, do better, and, um, you know, overcome the fear. So it's cool. Yeah, okay, David, I'm scared. But no. we fight in the 25th, bro. <laughs> I'm scared. These punches will be coming your, your way now. Don't get it twisted. Without giving too much away, what do you think is going to surprise him the most once he steps in the ring with you? I mean, just everything, just, just, just my movement and things, and the, and, the, and I think the shot selections that he might not be see coming, and him just walking into shots, and um, just frustration. I think I'm gonna frustrate him. And what's your response to his his dad saying the KO in round eight or nine or whatever? Uh, I, I told you my response. My dad's not here to respond. I'm not. I'm not getting in the dad in the. Thanks <laughs> for your opinion, but that's not what David said, so it's all good. It's me and David getting in the ring, you know? It's, his opinion is cool, but um, yeah, it's me again. And what would you think about Charlo's performance over uh, Canelo? Um, Charlo's performance over Canelo, I thought um, it was it was, just, it was bad, honestly. It was, he didn't show heart. He didn't show any of the glory part, you know? Not, that, was a, that was a type of fight where Win, lose, or draw, you're supposed to show glory, and he didn't show that part. That's 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 what that's when glory is supposed to come in on, on his end. Um, yeah, just. And, but at the end of the day, Canelo know what he was doing. He's picking a smaller guy that has never fought at 168. Um, that's, you know, nervous. Power difference, of course. A lot of people don't realize how much that takes in place and weight. And Canelo's probably... 190, 180 something, whatever his uh, solid guy versus a guy that always got to go down to 154 and he probably only puts on 65 to 75 pounds and then you're sitting there taking that extra real weight power because Canelo's not a pushover. He got he got real power and you, he's clearly seen it. But the point that he didn't open up any combinations, throw some stiff jab. Like he was just like waiting for Canelo and Canelo all he did was throw two shots. The hooks in his overhand right. So it was just like, dude, you gotta like get get a rhythm going on. You just letting him just fall right in place where he, where he wants you to be and you ain't do shit and then you I'm 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 a I'm a lion. I'm just blah, 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 blah. And it's just like yeah bro you did none of that. Um, how do you feel about obviously the, the, whoa, 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 the winner of this is the cat. mandatory of Canelo? How does that make you feel? Is it extra motivation? Listen, I already, I was Canelo was my mandatory mm -hmm. before. 154 pounds. He chose not to fight me. I got stripped for inactivity because like, I couldn't get things going. Um, and then he fights Liam Smith for my belt. Um, 160. He said he wanted to be undisputed champion at 160. I had the WBO belt. After he beat Triple G, he blamed it on paperwork. Listen, this is this fight's bigger than Canelo right now. Mm. This fight's bigger than Canelo. Canelo's cool. You know, if it happens, it happens. It doesn't, it doesn't. But this is this is a big fight right here. What's your message to all the people that are gonna be tuning in, either live or purchasing the pay per view? Um, <laughs> listen, buy the pay per view. Don't do that. Um. Streaming, yeah, streaming shit, fire stick, all this other bullshit, and me missing out and have like, yo, come on, man, this is a great fight, yeah, of course, man, you know, just like you season tickets holder for basketball, football, or other shit, or whatever you go and do, whatever, use the streaming shit for that, not when two guys are putting their life on the line and making shit happen and putting it all, putting all the marbles on to be the very best. 168 for me, it will be like the whole middleweight division because I've done been champion in both weight divisions. Um, that's a glorified moment. Mm. And obviously you're gonna seize that moment. Yeah, I'm definitely I'm definitely seizing that moment. I have no choice. I have no choice but to seize. That's it. Alright. Thank you, Demetrius. Alright, thank sure. you.